Hello everyone, it's Fred here from Hillian's Bricks and it's Friday night. Yeah, we're 9 o'clock Friday Lego deals. 60th one already, can't believe it. Uh, hope you're all well and that you've had a good week. And uh, the Lego deals are on this week. People on our Discord have been very active and we've been spotting quite a lot of deals this week. So, uh, could be a bit of an extensive session today. Um, I've got my drink ready. My kids are still up, uh, so but uh, they're both in the same bedroom, so that's a good thing. And um, as always, just before I get started, we uh, only do Friday Lego deals. Doesn't mean that the deals stop all the time, right? But we do have a um, what's it called? <laughs> An Instagram account and um, a Twitter account as well, and also have a Discord where we post all the deals throughout the week. So we recommend joining all those. There's links in the description of most of our videos on how to access those. So definitely recommend those because this, these are the platforms we, we post all the deals on. And as always, we all also recommend using uh, Cashback whenever possible. So there's two websites that we promote uh, that we use actually. It's QuidQuo and Top Cashback. Uh, more often than not, they have the same rates, but sometimes there's a difference between the two. So it's worth signing up for both of them and then uh, kind of compare which one offers the best rates for whichever retailer. So... There's a link for both of those in our description as well to sign up. But hi, hi Sim UK. So uh, I'm going to take a sip and uh, we're going to get started in a second with looking through our retailers because, uh, yeah, the deals are definitely coming and uh, it's to be expected. We kind of predicted it that towards the end of May we're going to start seeing the deals and I think next week might even be crazier as well because we're just up in, in the run up to the new sets that are coming out 1st of June. Uh, you know, some of the retailers, they have to start clearing some of the, the old stock. Hi, right, Stuart and Big Daddy. Let's get started, right? Uh, let's transition the screen. Um, again, for anyone, you can leave a comment in the chat. I do have my Surface Pro here on the right where I can keep an eye on the chat as well and uh, read any of your comments. But let's start with Tesco. I don't think there's much on at Tesco at the moment. Uh, looks like it's just Minecraft. Uh, these are not necessarily even the best deals. But as I say this every week, go and check out your local Tesco's for any clearances or anything like that. Because more often than not, you have deals in store that you don't even see online as well. So definitely go check out your Tesco's. Uh, next, let's check out Sainsbury's. I think it's going to be a similar story. office hi minion and Dan might need to move the mic closer Let's have a look I said that the volume was quite high on the mic is that better I don't want to attach it to me because then I'll just end up if I have a drink it'll be all noisy let me know if the sound if the sound is better or not I did move it a bit. All right, let's do a filter. I did filter. This Sainsbury website is always playing up. We get this every week. So they got a few 20% deals off. I wouldn't say anything spectacular here. Uh, again, go check out in store. The one thing I would recommend, though, is lots of people have been talking about getting uh, vouchers um, in Sainsbury's. I think some of them were even talking about... You had, I think it was like 18 pounds off if you spent 60 pounds or something like that. Um, I've seen some crazy discounts that you can get on top of that. And if you use them on top of, you know, already discounted Lego, that can make it a really good deal. Sainsbury's Plus, you get Nectar points as well. So, yeah, if you get those vouchers for future shops, use them on Lego to maximize your discounts. Cool. Uh, let's check out Asda. This could be getting it quite a while so let's first check out asda because there's two things we're going to check out asda first is asda groceries for any rollbacks and then we're going to look at georgia asda and if you were on our discord after midnight last night you will have seen there was quite a bit of activity unfortunately lots of stuff is sold out but let's look first on the grocery in asda and again yeah, i think you can get cash back Uh, Keith, I've had, um, very often I've had um, vouchers come out uh, out of the machines at uh, Sainsbury's, uh, not just for first time users, I've had repeat times that I've, I haven't been recently I must say, 
but I've had multiple times, even using the same Nectar card, that I get offers, not necessarily as, as good, but usually get offers for money off. So let's have a look what we've got. Any rollback deals online? Someone mentioned there are some sets potentially in store that might be discounted. Again, as I say, always go and check out the stores if you live near one. And I would also recommend taking, uh, I think now there's some stores that have the app, if not use the scan and go. Um, because sometimes the, the label is not up to date, uh, but if you scan it, it might show you a better price. So use the scan and go apps in most of these uh, stores to spot any of the deals. But it doesn't look like anything here, at least not online. No, not online. But there might be some in store and someone posted on a Discord just this evening. There was some stuff in Asda. Uh, let's go and have a look again Asda, but we're going to look at Georgia Asda. So we'll go this way. Toys. Let it load. People having a drink this evening? Or you're all taking it easy? My son had to go to A&E today, go and check out his elbow that he hurt at school yesterday because he was in such agony, even still this morning. We don't think he's broken it. They don't, can't even check it from the x-ray. But he's wearing some sort of sling to rest it. So let's just start with high to low. Uh, again, remember, George, I believe they have 5.5% cash back via top cash back. Uh, now, they had some great deals, but I think the good ones have gone. But we'll let's have a look. Some have been price matched on Amazon and some have disappeared again. It looks like they've already disappeared. They had the Ferrari uh, 188 for £96. That's gone. They had um, the Technic um, Land Rover. That seems to be gone. I think they'll be at the bottom out of stock. We'll see. What's still available at discount? Mm, seems like all the good stuff is gone. Oh, here we go. We got a few um, shopping mall. We've seen these. We've seen these cheaper. We've seen these at half price. The friends one. The city center is not bad. You get quite a bit of road plays and quite. A bit. I've parted this set out before. Uh, got quite a few minifigures. I don't think that's. It's not amazing, but it's not bad. Um. Come on, load. Uh, this creator, 3-in-1. Caravan family. I bought one of these, God knows how long ago. It must have been over a year ago. When it was one of those flash deals on Amazon, but you could only buy one. And I think I paid £37.50 or something at the time. But yeah, they don't, they don't really get that close. you got some of the, the Mario sets here. Um, that's a decent discount. Um, this friend's one as well. What else have we got? Got this the Disney Princess Rapunzel Tower. I'm on the fence on this one whether it'd be good for an investment now. I think. £33 is probably the price it should have been, but you're probably paying a premium because of the fact that it's Disney. Um, but probably quite an iconic set. Probably could be a decent one from an investment. I don't know. Minecraft Sky Tower. That's a decent discount, but I remember when Amazon Germany once had some crazy prices off. I bought some there for, in like the 20s, but we've not seen that again since. This is the, the most recent low that we've seen on this Minecraft set. The Speed Champion set, uh, very close to the price Costco have been charging lately. Uh, but then you get the cash back on top of this as well. I think this one might be retiring. I don't think it's done too well. I think the price point was very wrong for the UK market. And those are not that great deals. This was 22.50 in August, about two weeks ago. Yeah, these are just like 30% off. We've, we've seen these kind of deals on these sets.
So if anyone's got any comments or anything to share, I've got my eye on the chat as well, just so you know. Mm -hmm. Don't think they've got any further sets on discounts. And it's not worthwhile discounts. Getting towards the bottom. I guess the ones that I have sold out might be at the bottom. Or have they filtered them out already? They were there earlier when I checked. Come on. Oh, there's got a few here, which I don't think people are going to get excited about. And we know that. No, they're not even at the bottom. Okay. Uh, even the Technic Hovercraft, we could all get that from Tesco recently for a tenner. So I wouldn't buy that either. Alright, we've done these. Let's check out Argos. Oh, sorry, I'm hitting the mic. People are wearing headphones, they're probably going like, ah! So Argos, I think we're due a big discount at some point. I think we're due, especially maybe for the Jubilee, they're going to start doing some stuff. Um, we need to get some 40-50% discounts because Argos are one of those places, they need the space right to stock new Lego. And I think they're going to want to get rid of some. Oh, our bricks to go. Yeah, Mario parts out might be quite good. Just the issue I have with Mario is parting out. It's like how much demand is there for those parts. Um, that's my usual concern because lots of these parts here, they're very bespoke for uh, Mario theming. Let's start loading. This one's been on discount for quite a while, the Disney Mickey and Mini. I think I've got a few of those in my storage unit. The tow truck. This was another set that was discounted on uh, Georgia Asda but sold out quite quickly. I think it was about £78. Uh, this one's price matched a lot of places for £100. Still got Winnie the Pooh at 72. This is a good deal. This Ford F-150 at 70 pounds. It's a nice discount. I'm expecting bigger drops in prices on some of these sets. Part out price, Aaron. You go check out on um, on Bricklink. There's a thing called uh, price guide. You put in the number. It's literally. I think it's under market price guide. And you put the set number in it. Um, you will only see uh, it in your local currency if you have a store. If you don't have a store, you will only see it in US dollars. Because that's the default currency of the um, the platform. You need to have a store. And then you can see your own currency as well, what the part out value is. These aren't that great. Cheers, everyone. Still, these have these at the third off. I think that's decent back, back cave. Mm -hmm. You can get all these cheaper elsewhere. So yeah, sometimes I hover over deals because I know hey, they're either not that good or not good enough. Got this one, it's pretty good. Lego Friends Holiday Beach House. Now, um, I'm going to be covering Amazon later. This is price matched on Amazon. Um, yeah, this is this is a good discount. Mm. 
still trying to get rid of all these skyline sets. Huh? <laughs> Maybe I should just announce I will retire, that might help. Uh, Ford Mustang, that th it's been at this price for a while, but that's a good deal, I think. It's a nice uh, build. Keep mentioning it, but I haven't pulled the trigger on that one yet. I think I just need to, but I just, I'm really running out of space now. I keep saying that, but now I'm, I'm really running out. <laughs> Uh, Iron Man, twenty pounds. Uh, this is price match as well on Amazon because it might be out of stock where you are, um, but that's a very good deal. I think from a part out perspective, it hits the three to one uh, mark that most people will be looking for. But also, uh, I think even in the future, it will put potentially be a long term hold now because it's quite new. But that is a huge discount for this set if you're looking at it from an investment perspective. Don't be tempted by these two for thirties because you can often get the set for less than fourteen pounds. No, I think that's gonna be it for Argos. Oh no. well, wow, you can get it for fourteen fifty or two for thirty. What do you want? <laughs> Which one's the next one we're gonna do? Oh, we're gonna check out. I must say I haven't prepared for this one today. I've been quite busy. Now these are all the little sets, but none of them are really discounted. Okay. Oh, I keep hitting the mic. I want to push back a further bit. Sorry about that. Uh, let's check out Smiths. Smith's Toys. I always go straight to the cart. That's not what I want, but hey. Come on, shop all, where are you? Here we go, shop all Lego. And I did see some people mention that they've added some of the stuff that might be coming out on the 1st of June already. So that we'll have a look. Uh, what do we see? Mm -hmm. they got the new Lego freight train. I guess you can't order it yet. Pre-order. Okay. Wondering if you'll actually get it on the 1st of June or not. My son's going to want this. Yeah, I think they've done a good job with that one. The Space Shuttle. That was discounted on Amazon Italy earlier. They've got the new Rolling Stone set. That's going to come there. It's good to watch as well to see which one has the rare labels. Because that usually means it's... Not necessarily just an exclusive, but usually means it's not going to be sold in many places. Um, passenger train. This set looks beautiful. I like this set. They've done a good job with this. I think it's from a part out perspective. If, you, if we can get this set on discount, that'd be great. And I'm optimistic because it doesn't say rare, so I do think we might get some deals. So for me, that's going to be maybe if we get it less than a hundred pounds, might be targeting that one. Grimmauld's place. That's another new set that's coming out. So yeah, it's good to see all the new stuff. It's on the Smith's website. It's the first place I've seen so far that starts to list them. Um, bring on the deals, I say. New Ninjago one. Yeah, we're going to start seeing these disappear now, these trains. Yeah. Ministry of Magic. Oh, look at this one. 76126. Another Harry Potter new one coming out. 
got the tall neck. Have they got it in stock though? That's the question. I think they're coming back in stock in most places. I've had mine delivered this week. Yeah, look at that. You can order them if you want. See, this is a decent discount, 69. Vespa at 70. I'm still aiming for the Vespa to get cheaper personally. Uh, Yoda 69. I think RRP is 105 actually for this one now. There's not that many discounts though. Oh, bad batch here. That's not bad. Uh, the attack shuttle was 60 pounds. That's a price match to what we've seen recently in other places as well. It was recently like that on. Uh, on Argos. Um, it's just a bit of an instinct ready to see how many parts it has based on also the colors and the minifigure numbers and the theming. I just kind of make a quick assessment to think whether or not it's going to be a good one or not. It's kind of a second guess. But I'm usually not far off. You can kind of see if the if it, the price looks right or not. Oh, here we go. That's a good price. I think this must be sold out in most places. The Rise of the Duomo. Yeah, out of stock. Because that's a good deal. Let's see if it's available anywhere. Out of stock. Oh, Beckton. No idea where that is. Apologies for anyone that lives near there. Bromborough, Charlton, okay. Uh, Northern Ireland. Harlow, there's a few. Scotland. Liverpool. There's a few places still have it if you want it at 50 pounds. York has got three. The people who live near these places, they might want to pick that up. Not sure how well it will do, but. This is a 90 pound set, right? So it's not 60, 90 is the price for the Eternals. As cheap as we've seen it. Mm -hmm. The Gold Boat. Baby Groot. I like the look of this one. I, I like this one a lot. Not a Harry Potter fan, but I think this one I like. You know, if you have Hedwig and Dumbledore's Phoenix, you're going to want this one. So it's kind of you're building a series of them now. Um, any discounts? Nope. Can't see any more. I've also got the Black Cape Roll, the new 3 in 1 kind of mini modular sort of thing. Mm. Yeah, I've actually taken 1st um, of June off work and uh, I intend to go to the Lego store uh, to go check out all the new Lego. Not necessarily planning on buying anything, just want to film it. See what they have. Yeah, they've also got the Ford Mustang at thirty pounds. Armor of Mandalorian Forge. I think that's a good set. Oh, these these missions are oh, these these are new ones, aren't they? I guess is this with augmented reality or something that they're trying again to do? Yeah, interactive set. When will Lego kind of learn that we don't really want technology with it? Reason why people, why parents buy Lego for their kids is to get them away from screens. <laughs> At least that's what I do.
No, I don't think we've got any major more deals here on these little sets here. The one thing I'll say, interestingly, I started doing some analysis, right? These stunts uh, prices, compared to the US, it's, there's a huge difference in Lego pricing for stunts between UK and the US on some of these smaller sets. And I was flabbergasted. I think the US is getting ripped off big time, <laughs> if, I'm, if my memory serves me correct. Maybe they've adjusted the pricing since I put all the data in my sheet, but it just looked very wrong. <laughs> Yeah, stunts is definitely a theme I stay away from. Uh, they've got the Batman and Selena car motorcycle for a tenner. No, even the little sets are not discounted. No. Have they got the bathtub one? People are all talking about the bathtub one. I think that's the one that people. Does look does look good. But, as I said, I'm not into the stunts. So yeah, Smiths, be done in a second. Wow, we've got 60 people watching. I think it's going to be a new record, right? Cheers to that. So, we're going to go to uh, Hamley's. And I placed my order from Hamley's the other day, and it already arrived. You will see it in the, um, the vlog. But I ordered the tall necks. And... Well, let's just search for Lego. Shop full range. And it seems like the voucher codes, um, the discount codes are working again on most of the, the, the items. So you can get, you know, 10% off usually when you spend 40 pounds or more using cart 10 or new 10, I think. But you got to watch out. Sometimes it's not worth it because uh, Hamleys have a tendency of not having the right price in the first place from an RRP and overinflate some of the pricing. So what do we look? Because yesterday they had um, the bookshop on. That was good. There was about £135 you could get the bookshop. You can also get cash back with Hamleys. So again, make sure you take that into consideration. But are there any sets here that are worth it at the moment? So far, I'd say no. What's the point on four or five percent increase? See, this is what I mean by the wrong price. Why are you going to get 111 pounds for this? You can get it for 45 pounds elsewhere. Maybe they give you two. They give you a pair. Who knows? But I doubt it. Have they got any of the new sets yet? No. These, these small discounts just don't do it for me. Keep looking. Oh, hey, when does that? I didn't want to click on that. Let's just give. Their website at time to catch up. All right. A little more. No deals. Yeah. Disappointing. But sometimes with Hamleys, what you can do is like when the, some of the new sets are on, you can sometimes get a nice discount early on. Um, not, it's been a, quite a few months now since that's actually happened. I think they cottoned on to our tactic of maximizing the discount codes um, and cashback offers. And sometimes they also have pricing errors on their website and they don't honor them. You're, you're not going to get it if it's a clear pricing error. Oh, we go again, click on it. Hi, Rafael from Warrington. Thanks for joining us. So yeah, for any people who are new here, uh, welcome first of all. We do recommend you joining our Discord server though, it's completely free. And we've got, I think we must be hitting the 800 people mark either today or this weekend. 
uh, on the Discord where we have a nice Lego community. I would say it's maybe about 70% UK and then the rest of people all across the world, US and Europe and Australia, everywhere, which is nice. All talk things Lego. And looking for deals. I'm waiting for giveaways, right? <laughs> okay. Now, I don't think we're going to see much more than Hamleys. I'm just going to give up here. I'm sorry, guys, but I guess the Doctor Strange here. If you get two of those and an extra 10% discount, it's £18. Three minifigures. Maybe that's okay. Any other ones that are low value that are discounted that you can actually stack a discount? And one. I will go to all the way to the end now. I was going to give up and then they just enticed me in to keep going. Can't be many more now. 14, 40. Oh, you can get that for 13 elsewhere. 3 bus now. No. no. There we go. Let's go and have a look at John Lewis because we know they have some deals. Yeah, I think. Uh, Quick flipping is a, a risky business. It's not something I, I bought the tall necks. Uh, one probably gonna, my son's going to build. And then I'll have to decide what to do with the other two. Right, let's start with the usual. So John Lewis had some good deals. And let's see what they have in stock left, right? Because that's usually the main issue. <laughs> uh, this was on stock earlier today and quite a few of us on our discord got this so someone actually gave us an alert on the discord chat saying it's back on stock so i thank that person that did that because i got one as well so i've got one of these coming you know most likely cantina 33 percent off can't say no and i know some people have other ways to get additional discount using like moneasy and uh uh, other people who are actually employed at John Lewis get 25% off as well. So some people had a great bargain with the set, I would say. Uh, but even at 33% off, I think it's still a good deal. Old Trafford seems out of stock as well. Uh, Assembly Square. Now, we know that this went up by £50 <laughs> as of the 1st of January. So it's kind of just about where it was. But if people want it, I would say this is probably the best modular building if you want to build this. It is the biggest one and the reason why they upped it in price was essentially it was <laughs> underpriced it was too cheap for what it was which i think it, it was but yeah i got a few at the old price which is good but this is a good set to build what else do we see oh they got no the first time we've seen a discount on the boutique hotel surprise surprise it sold out already but keep an eye on it because sometimes they come back in stock even though we anticipate it won't before the deal comes out I wouldn't say that's necessarily a steal have we seen these cheaper got to aim like 90 pounds sometimes we bought these for these Porsches uh, the creator expert Volkswagen I think it's cheaper later on in this video so I wouldn't actually buy it at this price I think you can get it slightly cheaper uh, Mustang, 99, well, 100 pounds. Uh, I think the set's retiring. It's just a nice build. Uh, yeah. Wouldn't say no to that. It's not a set that's often discounted either. Oh, the White House, no, you can get this cheaper usually. You've got to aim for 60s low 60s bird of paradise they've had these at discounts at 33 percent before same for this one um, i think they got tons of stock on these two sets they're not doing that well 
similar price to what we've seen elsewhere. And um, Argos, I think it was seventy pounds. Vespers out of stock. That's interesting. Boba Fett throne room seventy pounds. I got a few here. I still haven't part them out. Still got some. Hospital it says ten percent. Tell you it's more than ten percent. It's an it's a ninety pound set. This. I think. I think they got this wrong. Fiat five hundred. Mm. Twenty-five percent. I think this set is retired now, but I don't think it'll do that well. Looks like the the chess set is back out of stock. The set goes out of stock as soon as it's available. We've got bad batch attack shuttle at sixty pounds. Just given. What else do we see? I'm waiting for um, Sonic to go down. I am expecting that to appear in the 40s at some point. See these sets cheaper on Amazon Germany. Again, they got this matched at forty pounds. Uh, out of stock for the Scout Trooper helmet. I have seen the Scout Trooper helmets cheaper though. That's not a too bad price. That one. Yeah. That's a decent discount. This Minecraft set. I think it's a fifty-five pound set. What else do we see? We also got the Mustang at at thirty pounds. Seems like everybody's got it at that price. Stock lifeguard station. I think this is price matched on Amazon. That's that's probably not worth that much. This one similar to what we've seen in uh, Amazon Germany for about this price. The lunar rover vehicle. And let's have a look at. I'm getting close to the end here on John Lewis. You see I'm actually paying a bit more attention going through all of them because I am seeing that there are more and more deals like the last few weeks I've just kind of been scrolling through these a lot more. This week is slightly different because the deals are here. 1350 yeah. Uh, these are price match. Why has this appeared on here? This is an old set. It must have suddenly had some stock from somewhere because this Speed Champ has been retired for donkey's years, I think. If anyone picked that up recently, they must have done quite well. <laughs> so that set's not been on there. And the little sets are not discounted either. 720, meh. Oh look, no, well, it's bandmates times two. It's not bandmates two. <laughs> All right, so that's John Lewis done. Uh, Costco. So Costco, you do need to be a member. It costs fifteen pounds a year. Usually, it's worth it. Um, cause they have some deals where 
it's like hot buy now we haven't seen any hot buys oh just talking about that <laughs> see straight away hot buy straight there uh, for quite a while uh, but I'm not even sure that's still a hot buy compared to what it is but let's have a look it's usually worth its fee and sometimes you even get an extra 10 percent 10 pound off when you just joined when I joined I got 10 pounds off uh, this is the cheapest I've seen the app controlled one well only by a pound but it's cheaper than I've seen before um, that's also a pound cheaper than elsewhere one pound ten cheaper than elsewhere and the same for these ones they've kind of lowered the pricing a bit huh, in Costco they must have been sitting on stock or maybe they're getting new stock for June as well so yeah we're seeing some lower prices so 64.99 I'm not sure that's good yet I think I'll go further. That's not even 30% off yet. Now it needs to be more. New friends set. Live up the price on this one now. Well, maybe a uh, Costco waking up, but still nothing to get me too excited about. Right, let's go and have a look at Cool Shop. So Cool Shop are based in Denmark, but you can order from them. They do have, um, I've ordered from them multiple times. It does take two to three weeks to arrive, uh, but you don't have any issues with import duties or anything in case you worry about that. And they also ship into Europe as well, so people watching in Europe may be, be interested in them. And you get cash back from them using uh, top cash back and the last few months has been 7.28 percent now i've not checked if that's still the case but i assume it will be but you also get some discount points that earned for future discounts on future sets which is another two and a half percent we do recommend you buy multiple of the set though just the way they ship the boxes and only order from them if it has this in stock item don't order if it doesn't stay in stock because you're not going to get it but let's see what they have. So the only set I would say here maybe is the VW camper van. Remember I said it was in John Lewis, £112. Said we'll get it cheaper elsewhere. Well, you can get it here for £110. But remember, you get 7% cash back discount points as well. So I think that's probably the best place to buy this camper van. Uh, I don't think at the moment there's any other sets necessarily worth highlighting on here. But they do, from time to time, have modular buildings on here, or like the space shuttle. Some of the bigger sets I've bought uh, is from this website. It'll be interesting to see when the new sets launch on first Ju on June 1st, what sort of pricing they have. Uh, this is not bad, I guess. £60. But yes, you gotta you got to compare the pricing because you can't get it cheaper usually elsewhere. Not all the time though, depends on set by set. But when we see a deal, we definitely post it, honestly. Oh, and this set, uh, wait for this week's vlog because this set will feature. This is a hard to find set in the UK. Well, we can get it RRP from Cool Shop. Usually they're not that good on the smaller value sets. They're just slightly above RRP sometimes. Oh, but yeah, I have a look at Cool Shop. Um, I've only had an issue once with them uh, when I ordered one set on its own, and they kind of like taped it in like a paper, cardboard paper wrap, and they stuck it to the box. So I took it off, kind of took part of the the box with it which wasn't too happy about but hey ho i've emailed them and they've not done it again so let's have a look hi kevin so yeah thanks mark for explaining but yeah uh, the, the our assumption is that we often see amazon price match offers in uk retailers as soon as they happen within 24 hours it's probably the same in in Germany. They're probably price matching uh, things in in Germany, um, and the pound has been quite strong recently. Although it's kind of weakened over the last few weeks, 
which might not make it as attractive going forward so we've got to keep an eye on that as well so let's check out Zavi Zavi is another one that does cash back so yeah the uh, minion yeah uh, you got to watch out um, on cool shop that's why I say only buy from them when it says in stock and it says they're not gonna get it so they just haven't updated their website so we've had people who tried to order things before I think it was like the roller coaster and it said expected in stock in like three weeks and then in three weeks came and then expected in stock another two weeks it never came people got their money back but it's just a hassle right so um, that's what I say only order when it says in stock then you you won't be disappointed on cool shop well, talking about guys who sometimes say in stock and might not have the stock we're at Zavi because these guys are notorious to try and say sell stuff they might not have yet um, let's see what they've got in terms of deals they've upped the pricing a little bit because this was 249 yeah they've upped their pricing a little bit versus last week on someone said it should still show some discounts but not as big as last week Again, another website I could do with an update, Downtown Diner. Uh, so far, I'm not seeing any deals here that are worth. Dun, dun, dun. I think we're going to go through Zavi quite quick. I think we need to wait for some sort of extra promotion to happen. Right now. No, no. Sometimes they have like three for two for like helmets or something like that. Oh. No. I guess if you want some Mario expansion, forty-five pounds. If you get some cash back as well, maybe, but not for me. Loads of sold out stuff as well. It's a bit disappointing at Zavi. I don't think I've won a bottle much more. So I don't think I've seen a single one yet. You know, every single set that I've seen so far, pretty much, I can say, oh, yeah, I can get that cheaper there, I can get it cheaper there. Or same price, it's just constantly, not the cheapest. Apart from this one, <laughs> um, and, and I was kind of looking for this one, um, the Mario Luigi starter course now. If you're looking for the Luigi starter course, because you've got the Mario one, you can get it for £25, and I'm pretty sure you get some cash back as well, so that's kind of a, a hefty discount. But apart from that, I'm not going to look for anything else on Zavi. Alright, let's uh, I'm going to check two more before we're going to head over to the Amazons. I want to start with Home Essential. Let's see if it's got anything on there. They have these discount codes, but I'm not sure if they work with Lego. Last week for me, it didn't work. So you see these codes here, depending on what you spend. And you also get cash back usually with the Home Essential. And I think their website is very easy to filter out the deals too. So 
um, let's just wait for it to load a second we'll just go to on sale love it how easy is that okay if those codes work above but I think you need to sign in and everything to check it so I can't do that now 11015 that's quite a hefty discount on this set I wonder how that is from a part-out perspective plus cash back 950 pieces that's the one I got from um, I got 10 of these from As uh, Argos for 2250 so I got slightly cheaper that's not bad that's too expensive go to hospital 68.99 We've got a few sets discounts if you can stack discounts and offers then it's worth it for sure like this friends main street 103.99 is the cheapest i've seen so far in the uk but i'm not sure if these things work with the discount codes i can't check it now yeah that's worth checking the rest is all full rrp I'm not going to go through it but, and I remember if you're a first time customer usually you get a good cash back offer as well and um, you also have Home Essentials and JD Williams they have the same website pretty much but they do cash back both sides so you can be a first time customer on one platform and a first time customer on the other one now I'm not sure if JD customer or JD Williams have these codes uh, in place let's check out very.co.uk they usually do some deals in a run up to a bank holiday so as we've got one coming in two weeks time or a week and a half oh well done Darren um, I didn't bother I just heard my phone beep uh, to go up in a minute cool uh, let's have a look see if there's anything that's uh, let's search low rated uh, price high to low I like the fact they can clearly see the, the savings. Oh, I might have to take a two minute break because my son's elbow is hurting. Just one second. My son had to go to A&E today. <laughs> Uh, so I might have to have a he might come down in a second to come and say hello but uh, yeah he had to go to A&E because he fell on his elbow yesterday at school and we had to get it checked and it's still I think it's badly bruised not broken but he might need some uh, paracetamol before I send him back up so I'm just going to see when he comes down Are there any deals here? Hmm. Not that amazing, I would say. No, that's thirty five in August. Wow, well, you say fifty eight P. Hello. You're in your gym jams and you're on the live stream, so is your arm still hurting? Really bad. Okay. Guys, I'll be back in two minutes. Emil needs some uh, calpol, right? Some paracetamol. Sorry for this, but I'll be back in a sec.
all sorted. Apologies for that. So, left music place. <laughs> uh, right, let's have a look, see where we're at. Um, oh, got the wife texting me as well. She's out in the pub and I'm dealing with this, eh? Hey, it's all good. Multitasking. To be fair, the missus never goes out, so. Loads of discounts, but not many that kind of grab the attention here. But I, I think maybe the bank holiday will bring some difference to very. Um, might we get some very, very good deals. Anything else? No. These deals are pretty much copycats of elsewhere from what I'm seeing. 28. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Harry Potter, mm. out of stock. Yeah, we've seen these prices elsewhere. Right? Eighteen seventy four. These were like John Lewis prices as well. Uh, you don't save ten pounds. It's not twenty eight pounds for that one, but it's still not bad. Eighteen pounds for those. Final page. No, I'm going to check out one more. Sorry about the microphone. I keep. Why do I keep hitting it? Let's put it there. That should sort it out. Uh, I'm going to check out Jadlem Racing because someone mentioned it earlier, and I haven't checked them in a while. Um, I do know they do Lego, but I feel they're also a bit of a reseller sometimes because they're selling Lego they're not supposed to be selling. I think in terms of that, they're not should be exclusive. Come on. I want Lego. This is not Lego. Can I just... Lego, here we go. Let's just search Lego. Lego shop. See all Lego products. Okay. I say see all Lego products. It starts coming up with display cases. See if you get a corner garage nuggets. Okay. See, I think this this is like a reseller, right? Selling above RRP. <laughs> Nothing's caught my attention yet. That's not bad. Um, White House, less than sixty pounds. That's usually the aim for architecture set. I think that's that's good. This one here, yeah, the White House is a good one. Oh, look at this. These are good. This hospital and an Ninjago. Dojo Temple. That's that's a good deal, people. Yeah, Darren, I think there's a filter on for uh, some words that shouldn't be used. It's, it's the YouTube thing. It's not me. It's automatic. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think these are not bad. 
Well, we got a uh, Sonica less than 50, but it needs to be much less than 50. Some of the new sets. So yeah, there, there's some sets here that are decent. Uh, although they got also the Rise of the Domo, the one that was 50 pounds in um, Smith, also here. Need to keep an eye on these guys more often, I think. Uh, also, Wildlife Rescue, I think I got this cheaper before. Also, I got this at 40. I think he, if you remember, you get some further discounts as well. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, this one here. They do have a, quite a big range. That's the cheapest I've seen it as well. Hmm. Yeah, these half price uh, video ones could be okay from a part time perspective. Um. Yeah, it's not too bad. Getting the lower value ones. Lots of these are at RRP. Or just slightly below it. That's cheaper than we've seen before. This lifeguard station, fourteen ninety five. Do these guys charge for shipping or something? I guess I'll have to try them out at some point. I've not ordered from them before, but I do know that they're legit because other people have ordered from them. Hmm, interesting. Got to keep an eye on this one. They got some clear and stuff, some old little ones, but yeah. Not going to clear at those prices. Oh, God. oh, so yeah, we check that one out. Let's go check out Amazon. Let's have a look. See, they got some good deals here. And let's go Amazon. We'll start with Amazon UK because that's straightforward and <laughs> usually there's not that many deals at the moment. Uh, I have a feeling maybe next week that might change. If it was like last year, 28th of May, was our Crazy Friday. Uh, it'd be nice if this year, Friday, 27th of May, is Crazy Friday. So when it comes to Amazon, um, most people will know that we give away lots of Lego on this channel and we fund that by you guys using our Amazon affiliate link. So for whenever someone buys something using our links, we get a commission and all that commission we get at the month, end of the month, about 60 days later we get it. We use that money then to buy Lego sets which we give away and we cover in terms of shipping it as well. So. We appreciate whenever people use our links, either if it's for Lego or non-Lego. So we've seen people buy dishwasher tablets, dog biscuits, all sorts of things. And lots of Lego, obviously, as well. So There's a link in the description of the video, I believe. But I'm going to look for a deal and then post it in the chat as well. And then you can use that link for any other uh, sets as well. you just got to go from there and then search in the box. Make sure you always use the link as the last way of getting to Amazon so that's the way it registers otherwise it won't register a pressed Lego filter come on let's have a look sorry the phone keeps going spot a deal that's worth mentioning 
I've often mentioned I like this set, the Ninja Ninjago Legacy Tournament. Just the fact you get seven minifigures for 19 quid. It's a good deal. What set can I post? What's worth? What's worthy of a dedicated post? Can't see it at the moment. Oh, I think I know what I'm looking for now. It's even on Amazon, they got it for 62. Uh, not that many discounts on here yet. So they haven't even price matched um, as the Georgia as I did it, uh, price match a few sets earlier today, but they sold out quite quickly at the pricing that went. Do, do, do. Come on! This rep not even going to post any single deal for Amazon UK. I'm not going to do it for dots. Not doing that, Mark. Da, da, da. I was hoping they had the, the Lego friend set that I'd seen earlier for 35. I forgot what the number was, but oh, here are some of the sets that are. Yeah, the selection is pretty poor. I might not even bother posting a link. Ah, oh, here it is. <laughs> Finally found it. Oh, I even nearly destroyed my uh, tablets. <laughs> right. I think this is a price match. There you go. 41709. Right. That's a, a beautiful discount, shall we say. Well, it's normally £60. 42%. Wait for the link to load. Yeah. Control C. Go to the chat. There you go. What's it called? 41709. What's 76206? Oh, the Iron Man's still in stock. So, yeah. We mentioned that earlier one. Uh, it was on Argos. 76206 that Mark is mentioning. Um, that was um, 20 pounds. It's still available on Amazon as well. So uh, if you if it's not available in uh, Argos near where you are, maybe you'll want to get it from uh, Amazon. I ordered some from Amazon and uh, they arrived as well. So uh, got a box full of them over there. Four of them. See if we see any more deals. I'm going to go to about page 20 and then we're going to check out some of the other Amazons. What do we have? 17. No. Here it is, 76206, what well, Mark mentioned, £20. Good deal if you're looking at parting out or future investment. Although, it is very early to invest in this set because it only came out this year. But it's a good price, right? If you're not worried about tying in some money, who knows? Keep an eye on the chat again. Let me just close the UK because I've got that one. That's an ink. It's a high price. Got the tall neck back in stock. Ok, 
Okay, one more page and then we're gonna go try some more different ones. He didn't price match the Georgia Astor deal. Right, let's check out different Amazons. So I didn't pre-check the other ones, but let's go check out Amazon France. Not had any deals from Amazon France lately. Uh, I am still waiting for a three for two deal. Now with the Amazons in Europe, uh, here's worth what we need to know. You gotta aim to optimize the shipping, you don't have to, but to optimize it, you always wanna get as close as possible to around 180 euros. Now this number might change depending on exchange rates. But that's the sort of number you're aiming for to avoid having import duties calculated and to maximize your shipping cost because even if you have amazon prime in the uk you will pay a shipping cost to order from amazon europe into the uk uh, but the shipping cost is not per box you order it's kind of like a bulk cost i think it's like how they package it in terms of the size of maybe cubic meters or however they measure it i don't know but the more you order, you don't pay per unit. So it's optimized shipping if you you maximize it that way. And then clearly you want to avoid the duties because you don't want to pay that tax if you don't have to. You can place multiple orders as well, uh, just every time under that threshold. The beauty is that the Amazon cost breakdown model on the right hand side always shows you what it will be like and whether it includes the, the duty or not. So you want if it hits, includes the duty, you might want to lower a little bit of your spend. So that's how it generally works. So let's check if Amazon France got anything worth mentioning. Nope. Thanks, Stuart. That'll all go towards the future giveaway funds. We were looking for future three for two deals on Amazon France. Uh, but at the moment, I don't think there's anything majorly discounted. Um, Again, if there is, we do post them deals where we keep our eye on on these Amazons. Uh, and people, obviously, who are look, watching in Europe, um, you guys don't have to worry about the import duty. You can uh, order more than 180 euros worth. Uh, incidentally, when I post the deals on my Discord, on Instagram, or, or on Twitter, I always post them from a worst case scenario. And what I mean by that is because there's a a currency translation that takes place now if you have a, a, a certain cards that don't charge you for foreign transaction fees then by all means make the transaction in euros you're gonna get a better exchange rate but I always put my pricing based on the Amazon fixed exchange rate and I know that's not the best value uh, but just to give you some sort of idea of how the cut of how the the prices are based on you can actually save a bit more money But no, I don't think Amazon France is going to be something we're going to be highlighting this week. Uh, even with coupons. And I didn't expect it to. Uh, no. Not this week. I'm just, I'm not going to check further. I'm just going to check out Amazon Italy. Uh, we recently restarted our um, affiliate links with them and they've had some uh, they do the odd set at a decent discount so and it's usually the big sets so I think we had the tree house this week let's see what else is currently available tree house has gone back up in price they had the Technic uh, McLaren as well, so that's gone up in price, and they had the shuttle, so maybe there's not going to be anything from Amazon Italy either. But yeah, this is why we recommend joining our Discord, right? So it's the deals don't just happen because I'm on here. Oh, and they had, um, you can see I still got it in my basket, the um, Nintendo as well. I think that stopped as well by looking at this price, 219 So yeah, I think Amazon Italy might be a quick one as well. A 
because the general pricing is expensive compared to what we'll see in a minute from Amazon Germany yeah. it's a no no I don't even want to check further so we're going to check out the final one actually did we check out Spain? we didn't did we? España Again, we might not have a deal for this here. Let go. Come on, give me the Lego already. Anything worth in Spain? bizarre that we had some good deals on earlier in the weekend now ready for the weekend they stopped oh this one is a uh, I ordered recently from Spain and I ordered this one here so I'm gonna post it let's just uh, close the other ones that we don't need uh, but you don't just want to order this set right you clearly want to order something else because the the freight cost will eat into it but if there's other sets that are worth buying I'm gonna keep looking but this set here this uh, I think it's something ambush 10 euros 90 it's a 45 percent off on this set i think the minifigures alone are worth more than what you'll end up paying so i'm gonna have a look see if there's something else worth combining it with so i combined it i think it was with the goat boat so let's put that this is spain lego Are we on 76154? That's that one. Uh, let's have a look, see if there's anything worse. That's no, not worth it. Don't don't get tempted by Oferta Flash. Flash offer doesn't necessarily mean it's a good deal. So they had some of the the mechs as well on discount earlier in the week. I ordered the Madrigal house as well, but that was discounted more. It was thirty nine ninety nine. Oh, they got the price back up of the goat boat, so no, not worth it. in Spain no. I'm afraid not not at this moment in time but we always got to keep looking because you never know you know what's going to happen once suddenly the deals start happening in the UK they're going to start happening everywhere and we're just going to be <laughs> it's like a tsunami of deals that's probably going to happen within the next few weeks Let's go and check the final one, which I know is going to have deals, and that's Amazon Germany. So, Lego. You guys all still with me, or have I all bored you to death with Lego deals? Thanks so for all of you guys who are sticking by. I think it is probably the, the most watched live stream we've had so far since we started this channel. I think we hit over 70 earlier. Right. Uh, I straight away see some deals already. Um, this one here, uh, the Jedi training. Uh, 
I built this actually last night. Really good set, a thousand pieces. Not bad. Um, the big tumbler at 159 euros, that's not bad either. So let's just pick. We, we can choose, right? But I think the best value here that I see so far in all of these is probably the Harry Potter hospital wing. Now, I posted this deal before, but again, remember you can uh, go via this link to any of the other sets. If you plan on placing multiple orders, click the link uh, every time before you place an order. Because they I've even got a notification. Last time I bought this it was in in March. Yes, I did buy this set in the March. I think I part out the minifigures. So Lego seven six three nine eight. Okay, what else have we got? Some battle packs, nah. Uh, the Technic motorbike, that would be cheaper than any way you can get in the UK at the moment, I believe. That would be close to £140 maybe, maybe a bit less. Depends on the exchange rate. Uh, got some of the new Harry Potter, uh, Potter, Potter uh, Hogwarts moments. This is one of the newer ones. €19.85, so it's probably about 17 18 quid, depending how many you buy, what you combine it with, obviously. Uh, what your ultimate shipping cost will be in the total. Um, Luke Skywalker's Red 5 helmet, that's the cheapest we've seen as well. That's probably about 38 39 quid. Again, depending how many you order. Um, they've got the trench run. Uh, if, if you haven't entered our giveaway yet, uh, on Sunday the last code for the vlog's coming out. So that's one of the. Well, we're giving three of these away. Then. Two weeks from today, actually the 3rd of June, we're going to do the giveaway. So um, that's coming up. So keep your eye out for that one. But that's a good good value deal, that. Probably about 40 quid for a £55 set in the moment in the UK. Hmm. Uh, yeah, got the ATST. Just about, probably about £30, £31 maybe. And you can do a combination of sets, right? If you don't want to buy multiples of a certain set, if you just want to buy a few Lego sets and buy the optimal price, you can just buy one of this one, another one of that one, and add them up to get to 180 that way. So some of these Speed Champions are the cheapest that we've seen. Although they have been cheaper on actually Amazon Germany. Yeah, we like Amazon Germany. Um, generally, good value. Remember, this is 114 pounds in the UK at the moment. This will be close to 100 pounds, 105 pounds, maybe. I mention this every week, but if you need road plates or train track for your Lego city. Amazon Germany is 95% of the time the cheapest place to get it from. €12.72 for these row plates. Uh, again, you'd probably want to order multiple again. Yeah, you'll see later on it should be the same for train tracks. It's be about the €13 Euro mark. That's a good deal as well for this Lego City space station. It's a nice discount that. I think this is a 55 pound set in the UK and that'll work about 33 pounds so it's a yeah 40% discount if I don't got, got it wrong see here's train switches it's a discount else do we see <laughs> I haven't got it in my basket yet to buy I was just looking what the price was for the last one mark so <laughs> 
I still need to buy my prizes for next month and I'm undecided well it's going to be a bit of a late announcement again on how to enter that one but there's a reason for it you'll have to be patient okay we're getting to the area where there's no prices <laughs> means they don't ship them to the UK or they don't have stock uh, no not worth it Go a few more pages and then I need to go check if my kids are actually asleep. <laughs> Here's the other straight train track at discount, not bad. See how they have two listings for the set one at 36 euros and one at 55. I know which one I'd buy. I think we're seeing many more deals here. Sometimes the, the later pages are worth checking um, because some of the newer offers tend to be the, the, the further pages. But once they start selling, they, they rapidly come to the front when people spot the deals because it's the more popular sales that usually appear earlier on. But no, I don't think there's anything else left here on. I guess this uh, Lego Friends set, this new space one, it's quite a good set for, for friends I think, the space one, 50 euros, that's probably about 45 pounds. Yeah, I've got a few more pages. No. These are all some old sets. A lot of them. No. I'm not feeling it. But yeah. I think we're all dealt out in terms of Lego deals. Uh, I hope you found some interesting stuff. If not, I'm sure there will be more interesting stuff coming in the next few weeks. Uh, this is probably the best time of the year to look at and start to see Lego deals. Uh, if anything is last year to go by. So uh, I'm hopeful next week we might see lots more. But yeah, if you're new here, we definitely recommend joining our Discord. We can't emphasize that enough. It is the, one of the more active communities that we have here in terms of all the Lego. Well, we hope you enjoyed tonight's stream. Uh, there'll be lots more videos coming up uh, over the next few days and weeks. And uh, we'll see you around at the next one. But yeah, thanks for watching. And uh, we'll see you soon. Bye for now.